Uh, good morning, y'all. It's uh, March, late March the eighth, uh, Thursday, and uh, actually running a little bit late behind this morning. Uh, got a little, got to get out, get the kids out to go to school. But uh, I wanted to share something with y'all. Uh, some of y'all that know that see this page or see my posts know that not only am I a beach body coach, but I also help people with their nutrition and building meals for them. And um, I do little things like prepackaged meals like wraps and sandwiches and uh, even some dinners. And I can't probably turn this one up, but this one is like a chicken piccata. And it's all, you know, kind of prepackaged, under 400 calories and, you know, built and customized. And, you know, it just takes my passion and uses it to help people. And uh, I saw a post yesterday from a friend of mine who is struggling to figure out what to do with their passion and how to make it work with their current schedule. And I know for me, it's tough because, you know, for me, I have to work out, got to raise family, got to drive an hour to work and come back and do it all over again and get the kids to bed and cook dinner and et cetera, and et cetera, et cetera. So this morning I got up at 3.35 and uh, you know, didn't get a chance to work out because I had to cook the meals because I had to go up to bed early last night. So I get up and do that. So, you know, got up this morning at 3.35, cooked lunches and dinners for folks till about 6.30, got the kids ready, got their breakfast ready, got them fed. Um, but in the middle of Mr. Cooking, I realized that I came short on a couple of ingredients. And, uh, you know, you can't leave kids at the home. You can't run to the grocery store at 5 in the morning. So what do you do? And I just remember, you know, praying out loud, God, just help me. This is your gift. Use it the best way you can. Help me to do, just help me get through this. And, you know, I just kind of, you know, seemed like the light wasn't coming at the end of the tunnel. And while I was listening to my, my iPhone and my Spotify, the song that's playing in the background came on. And it's called uh, Turn It Around For Me, Turning Around For Me by Rashawn Mitchell. And I think that was God's answer to my prayer. And that just, you just hold on and push through. Um, he's going to turn things around in your favor. And I just remember just getting this insight into just, hey, switch this ingredient, change this out. Um, you don't have eggs, just, you know, um, you know, use honey mustard and bread it. You know, that way you just take out the eggs. I probably save calories in the end anyway. And I came out with some fantastic dishes. And, you know, a lot of times we get frustrated because we have this gift. And because of our environment, because of our work situation, because of our things that's going on, we don't know what to do and we lose hope, we lose faith. But just hold on because things are going to turn around in your favor. Just hold on. He's going to use you the best way possible, but you've got to be willing to be used. you got to say, God, use me the best way that you can. God, this is your talent. Use me to, to glorify your name. Take the money, take the fame, take the prosperity, take all the material things out of what you're doing. Make sure you're doing it for the right reasons, and he will use it. And it's not easy. It's not fun. You will lose sleep. I got up at 3.30 this morning and I got to get my workout in it. So guess what? When I come home and get the kids to bed and cook dinner, I got to get on and get my cardio for an hour. So it's going to be hard, but it will turn around in your favor. Just when you think you're at your hopes in is when things turn around in your favor. Just when you think you're at the end of your journey and you can't go any further, it's going to turn around for you. When you think that you can't lose any more weight, when you think that this workout is too hard and you want to give up, things are going to turn around in your favor. When you can't figure out what to eat or you feel like there's nothing set up for you to succeed, things are going to turn around in your favor. When you're struggling with your finances, when your kids are struggling, when they're having issues in school, when you don't know how you're going to pay the bills, when you don't know what the next move you're going to make, the next meal you're going to eat, the next job you're going to get, it's going to turn around in your favor. Just believe in that. Hold your faith. Don't give up. And just remember to be used. Seek Him first. I still got to drive an hour and deliver these four meals to folks, and it's, the day's not done. But I just wanted to share this with you because I know I'm running late, and I know if I wait, I won't send it out. But I just believe that today he's going to turn around for you. I think today is the day you get to see the, the light at the end of the tunnel. And it's not going to be easy, but remember, just keep holding on. You guys have a great day. Again, I'm here if you need help. Marie's Mantle, www.facebook.com forward slash Marie's Mantle, Marie's Mantle.blogspot.com. I love you all. God bless. Peace.